Okay, I don't think I had the mic on. Let's try that again. Okay, and I think the audio actually sounds pretty balanced. So I think we're ready to go. Uh, might be a little loud. Okay, let's try that. Sounds. Okay, but I think we're ready to play here, so, uh... Head back to the, uh... Whatever you call it, place. Kinda cool you have all this area to explore here. Can talk to them to get more uh, more gear, but I don't really have enough money right now. So let's just play a game. Kind of cool you can take this little shot practice. Whoops. Yeah, that won't cut it. Oh, it's raining. Oh, man. Hold one. It's a par four. Okay, let me test out this chat box here. Just to make sure it works. It should be fine. Oh, PS4 streaming noob. Oh, yep. There it is. Cool. Alright. Oh, yeah. Cool. I just did a quiz and I got um, this new camera that lets me see the shot from where the ball's going to land. Well, that's no good. Come on, stay on the fairway.
cool. Nice shot. Sweet shot. Good work. You look strong already. Of course, now that I'm playing live, you know, you <laughs> as well. Here. Did pretty good early, earlier today, though. I got my first hole in one. Down. A break to the left. A pass to the left. How exhilarating! Really cool that you can make your own character in this. Two. It's par four. I'm not good at making a character that looks like me, so I just made it the opposite and made a girl. Uh, yeah, but um, I picked up the uh, PS4 here yesterday. Um, I got two games with it. I got this and No Man's Sky. I wanted to get World of Final Fantasy, but the store I went to didn't have it. Oh, shit. Well, that's no good. Looks like the rain's letting up. back there. Oh well. Oh, I should have used my power shot. It's par five. Damn it. That's okay. That's okay. I'll make it work. Hey, Sega CD Universe. How's it going? Fair enough. I wanna go home. Cool. Nice shot. Yeah. Hey Derek. Good luck. Oh, I love this series. Here. Been playing it since the very first one on the uh, PS1. You'll be okay. A break to the right. Which was actually made by Camelot, if I'm not mistaken, and then they went on to make like the Mario Golf games. Uh-oh. Nice birdie! 
Let's keep it up. <clears throat> Actually, I had no interest in golf at all until I started playing this this series, and then like shortly after that, I started playing golf in real life. Um, I don't anymore, but just because it's too expensive and like um, you really have to commit to it to to get good. <laughs> yeah, I almost bought that movie yesterday. I don't own it. But I ended up going for, like, the Resident Evil collection instead, which I know, like, people make fun of because they're, they're not as good as the games, but I like them. At least the first two movies. non-healthy channel. Yeah, mine too. Um, I always love that line in there where it's like, I eat pieces of shit like you for breakfast. And he's like, you eat pieces of shit for breakfast? He's like, no. Oh, here comes the rain again. Man, I can't, can't believe you're still grinding it out in Breath of Fire 3. Enjoying some Iron Maiden beer with my golf today. Come on, fight! You'll be okay. Breaks to the right. <clears throat> Been a couple of years since I had it. So no more item pie. farming or whatever. Waiting for a rare drops. Yeah, where the hell is the hole? Way over there. Okay. No! Oh no! Oh dear. Crap. Go. Oh. A 1 in 256 drop rate. Ugh. Still got a long way to go here. Holy cow. Oh well. All right. Oh, what happened to your controller? Yeah, 
Yeah, true, but some games are easier than others. For completing it. Like, for instance, Xenogears, outside of the, uh, um, the RPS kit at the beginning, um, it's relatively easy as far as I know. It's just tedious going through that battle arena stuff. Ah. Hi, Simon. We'll Simon wants to play. Oh, let's see. A little bit of wind. Oh, he's in the keyboard. Eee. Well, keyboard does work fine for RPGs, but I don't know. I just get annoyed with it after a while. Careful. I see. It's Down like here? my brain isn't wired to, to use left. a keyboard for video games. Because it's it's never like a, a smooth, like movement is never smooth for me because I'm just like, I always have to think about what button does what. Oh yeah, somebody probably figured that out by accident for sure. Sloping up. Really? Oh, really? Well, that stinks. Oh, no. Hold six. It's a part four. <laughs> oh, yeah, the camera controls. <laughs> Give it a good shunt. Oh man. Oh, I only found it because I used the strategy guide when I bought the game. I think it's very cool that it does that. Like you can have her as like the little little kid like character or you can evolve her into like an adult. Yeah, I think that's the one he means. Downhill? Breaks to the right.
Great work. Yeah, that's the one I was thinking. Oh man, now I'm even again. Crap. Part seven. It's a part three. <laughs> well, Simon, you gotta bring me the ball, otherwise I can't throw it. I can't throw what I don't have, man. You gotta love any movie that, you know, features a fight with a... Yeah, I played Grandia too. You gotta love any movie that has a, a fight with a game show host in it. Could make a birdie! Yeah, I played Grandia 2, uh, both on Dreamcast and PlayStation 2. Left. Obviously, the Dreamcast version was much better than the PS2. There it is. PS2 one is like still playable, but um, like it's got some frame rate issues, especially in towns, and it's like got some weird visual glitches. And then a couple times. Um, I got out of battle and it just went to a black screen and froze and I lost like, you know, 30, 45 minutes of progress. been a while since I, like, well, it's a couple of years ago. I don't think I did know that. Close, got really close to that sand trap there. Oh, good really? approach. Just three ducks. It's hard. He did it by accident. The finale! Port nine! It's a part three! Yeah, one thing I hate about fights like that is, you know, unwinnable fights, is when the enemy, like, because a lot of unwinnable fights, like, you can tell you're not supposed to win because the enemy hits you with, like, some attack that you have no chance of defending against, like, you know, does max damage or whatever, but then 
some enemies kind of kind of make you feel like you can beat them, but you're actually not supposed to. That annoys me. Because then you like start burning through items and stuff. Zero damage to Ryoto or uh yeah Ryoto. Nice <laughs> Ooh cool I got a flannel. Now I can make a hipster character. That's what I should make for my next custom character. I should make with the total like gaming hipster guy. Dark rimmed glasses and a beard and a flannel. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. I like how ridiculous this jump is. Like, look at that. It jumps like 10 feet in the air. Zero damage to you too, that's Okay, let's awesome. go. Time to go. Well, not awesome if the battle lasts forever and nobody wins. there's a way to like earn coins faster in this game because I noticed some of the items you can buy in the shop cost like 3,000 coins and you only get a hundred per victory here Everything levels up as you, as you like, you know, gain experience with, you know, whatever club. I 
I kind of make fun of games sometimes for having RPG mechanics, but I think they actually work pretty well in here. Fight the show. And it makes sense too because, you know, in real life, if you use clubs more and more, you get more used to them. And you have better control, you know, it's a you can hit them hard, farther and stuff. That one perfectly. hoping to hit those people in the head. You look strong already. For the birdie. You can do Holy it. cow. Downhill? A break to the left? Three hours? Jeez. I suppose, though, you don't want to, like, have to start over and get all the way back to that point in the game. Hole three! It's a par five! <laughs> yeah, that's a good point too. You spent two days maxing out their stats. <clears throat> I don't know what I would have done at that point. I probably... I don't know, I probably would have just put the game down for a, a while and then came back like a few years later and then just started over. There's so many PS4 games I want right now. Like, I know for sure I want to get Dark Rose Valkyrie. That game looks pretty cool. Um, I Am Setsuna looks really good. Uh, I wanted to get both of the... I think there's only two uh, Atelier, Atelier games or whatever. <laughs> Your OCD would murder you. Oh yeah, and I have Bloodstain coming whenever it releases this year. Because I got the PS4 version. That's going to be awesome. Oh yeah, and I wanted to get the Ratchet and Clank reboot. Oh yeah, um, I heard Tales of Ber Berseria is one of the best ones. Good luck. 
So I wouldn't mind getting that one. Further chance here. Relax. Sloping up. That breaks left. Oh, really? Careful. I did see the Final Fantasy XII um, Zodiac Age or whatever for PS4. That kind of pisses me off, though. Like, I don't like the game anyways, but um, what pisses me off about that is that one got a physical release, but Final Fantasy IX didn't, as far as I know. Final Fantasy IX is a much better game in my Let's opinion. Keep it up. Hold a four. It's par four. When I first started, my max my max distance with the one wood was like 183 yards, and now it's over 200. So you're not a fan of the Zodiac Age either? I'm I'm actually not really a big fan of the whole Evil East Alliance thing. Like it used to be just Final Fantasy Tactics and well Vagrant Story was kind of part of that too. But then they added started adding like all this shit to it, like tactics advance, and it's like no. I don't know, I enjoyed Final Fantasy XII at first, but it seemed like after about 15 hours or so, the story just kind of, like, went away. Oh, hey, Majority! It seemed like the story, like, it either went away or it just got, like, lame or something, and all you were doing was just fighting, and I really didn't like the battle system that much. Oh yeah, look at that skill. Yep, I'm all about the back door. Okay, not really. Oh yeah, I saw your new comment uh, video series came up today. Still have to watch it yet. Okay. Right, part five. Oh, you have this game? Damn it! Are you guys gonna make me get PlayStation Plus? Well, it's really awesome. I don't know if you've played any of the other games in the series, but um, this this one is really, really good. That's what I've played so far. That's okay. I'm sure other people are going to ask me to play online, so I might just end up getting it.
Oh, really? I didn't know that, so like... So like, we could both play online even though only one of us has plus? Is that what you're saying to me, man? Raiden 5 actually looks kind of disappointing to me, but Darius Burst, like I played the, the PSP version and that one is really good. <laughs> Too poor for games. Yeah, plus with PlayStation Plus you get free games, you know even though you're paying for a service and you're not actually getting free games, you're, you're paying for a service. Okay. I know people get upset sometimes if you talk about that, like, oh, they're free. No, they're not. I have Hulu, that doesn't mean I get free TV shows. I have to pay for Hulu. Yeah, it's similar to Gaiden. Cool. Um, it, it's a little bit different, but you know, it's close enough. Yeah, I have to watch that. I think. Yeah, mine has one terabyte. Nice. Yeah. Could make a birdie. Sloping up. Focus. A birdie. <laughs> Got this. Nice birdie. Beautiful. Oh, you probably have more games than I do too. So you, you probably have to like delete stuff to put new games on there. Yeah. Yeah, that's the thing that bothers me about the system. It's par four. <laughs> Some people get really mad about that, like, like, it's a free game. No, it's not. Um, but yeah, that's one thing that bothers me about the system is, like, you can't just, like, pop in a game and play it because... If you don't have the space, you have to free up space and, you know, put it on there and everything. I haven't run into that that yet, obviously, because I just you know, got it two days ago. Yeah, that too. Yeah, plus a lot of the games I'm going to play are like, you know, RPGs and stuff, which, you know, they're not AAA games, so they shouldn't take up that much room. Like, I was looking at some downloadable stuff in the store, and like, a lot of the stuff I want is under 10 gigs. So it shouldn't be too much of an issue for me.
Oh yeah, and I also wanted to get uh, nice Valkyria shot. Chronicles Remastered. Because I don't own the PS3 version anymore. Uh, definitely want to pick up the Sky of Five. <laughs> yeah. My next opponent will show up after this game. I'd imagine I'd have enough experience. Okay, that's a not go where I thought it would. For the birdie. Don't rush it. That's a long shot. Yeah, uh, PlayStation Rich does that right. every once in a while. They just send out like three ten dollar vouchers at random. Like I got one. The last one I got was oh, like five years ago, and that was. That was when I didn't really have any game systems anymore, except for like the PS3 and the PSP. So like I downloaded something off, you know, for free. Don't remember what I downloaded. But, you know, it was a nice little bonus. Sonic Mania, Ghost Blade, and Darius Burst. I also want to get uh, Pulsar. I think it's called like Neo Geo Pulsar or something. that Sonic 06 is the best game ever made. Way better than Sonic Forces will ever be. What a result! Congrats! <laughs> dirk, dirk. Yep, I do like my shmup, so I will take a look at it. There's a lot of PS4 stuff I gotta look at.
Uh oh. May have hit that one a little bit too hard. Cool. Or not. Accumulating some highlights already. That's nice. Uh, I see you over there, Simon. Last one. Hold nine. It's a par three. Is this distracting? Is it hard to take your shot when I'm doing this? why but I really like that little music bit there. Look at that. One by eight strokes. That's okay, this is really early on. It'll get much harder eventually. Ain't that something? No surprise there. upload channel. Oh, I got 100% fairway hits? No way. Look at that greens and regulation. Pure evil. <laughs> Why golf? Why penguins? character kind of looks like me. A prize! Woohoo! Woohoo! Great play! Nice work! Nice work, babe! Get stuck over here. Okay, so let's check out the shop real quick. Welcome. Yeah, see, I've only got five hundred. <laughs> One video a year, huh?
Oh, I can actually afford something now. I think I want to save up for something, though. What the heck is that? Oh yeah, that's real money. I don't want to do that. No, I refuse. You come back soon. Ooh, I can buy her grumpy voice clip if I get 2,500 more coins. Too bad I can't listen to that and sample it. What streaming service do I prefer? Are you talking like OBS or PS4 or whatever? I don't know, I like this one, it's really simple to use. Like I thought, cause I, I looked up some videos and I, I thought that you'd have to like, um, what is it called? Like, you'd have to have, like, some kind of confirmation code to, um, enable YouTube. Like, to enable YouTube to access your account or whatever, but I didn't need that. Like, I just signed in and I hit broadcast and that was it. I do really like OBS a lot, though. But obviously there's no need for me to use OBS if, I'm, if it works just fine with this. <laughs> I like how they jump back when you charge at them. Ooh, I can get a snobby voice. Too bad you can't ride the surfboards. You can go in the water, though. I don't know how far. Look at that, a cruise ship. Nope, I think I hit the border. <clears throat> oh yeah, there's a verse character over there. Yeah, I, I know there's a few games like that, like it'll just go to that blue screen. Like I remember Persona 5 was like that. Like Atlas didn't want people streaming it. And actually I don't see the harm in people streaming it because obviously if you're watching a Persona 5 stream, you know you're gonna see spoilers because well that's why you're watching it because you want to see the story um the bigger issue i have with stuff like that is you know when when you just hop on facebook and you know some idiot just blurts out you know critical points of the story no spoiler tags or anything it's like thanks thanks a lot okay so that'll be my next opponent
How to broadcast multiple audio sources. Um... What do you mean, like game audio and mic audio, or something else? Because I know, like, some people have, like, while they're getting stuff set up, they have, like, background music playing. And, you know, just, like, a, a static image on screen saying, you know, starting soon or whatever. Oh, you haven't been able to stream it at all. Wow. Huh. The, the one thing, like, I noticed with OBS is, um, because I have my my mic audio set on a delay of like I don't know like excuse me like two thousand milliseconds or whatever, but um, it's usually fine. But if on my my uh, web browser if I mute the YouTube video, then like any kind of echo goes away, as far as I know. Hmm. Here we'll check out my awesome hole in one because it was awesome. Oh, okay. Yeah, that's weird. Oh, at first, actually, I remember I couldn't get the mic audio to work at all because, like, the Elgato sound capture software was interfering somehow. Like, I don't know, like, what did it do? I think it just muted everything. Like, I couldn't get sound at all. Oh no, no, I remember now. I couldn't get the mic to work and I was like, well, I know the mic works. I use it in videos, but like it just wasn't broadcasting sound no matter what I did. And then I, I figured it out, which I was glad I did because I was looking up solutions online and it was saying like, oh, you need to like uninstall your sound drivers and all this other stuff. I'm like, oh, I don't want to do that. Uh, no, that was just lucky. Like, well, obviously, on any par 3, you want to get a hole-in-one, but that was not intentional. It was just a lucky hit. Yeah, I I've played, like, an hour of No Man's Sky so far, and I can tell I'm really gonna enjoy that game. I know the game didn't get like the, the best press or uh, reviews or anything, but yeah, like I'm gonna love it because like you have to like you know mine for items to repair stuff and like you get to fly around space and all that. I think it's gonna be really fun. I'm still trying to repair my ship. Actually, I think I can fly with it now, but I don't think I have like the the turbo engines or whatever. Oh, Toadstool Tour. Oh yeah, I heard that game's supposed to be really good. Ooh, she's got a sexy voice. Definitely want to get that. Oh, 
definitely get, get some mesh tights. That would make my character look cool. My, my super manly character here. bother me that much. <laughs> Run to these bastards. Get out of my way. Like I fell over? Cool. Oh, I didn't know, realize I could knock people down. That'll keep me occupied for like three hours. Not on stream, but you know. After I've had a few more beers later, I'm just gonna run over some people. Get out of my way. Wait, I get to run over kids too? Okay, um, yeah, but I'm actually going to wrap it up for today, so I um, want to thank you guys very much for hanging out. <laughs> I could do that. Put some, like, uh, put some metal in the background and just have my characters just running over people. Actually, I could probably make, like, a totally metal character. <laughs> it's weird. Like you wouldn't expect it in a cutesy game like this. <laughs> well, thank you. I'm looking forward to uh, checking out a lot more games on here. But yeah, I'm going to wrap it up for today. So uh, thanks for hanging out, guys. And I will see you next time.